All right, how's everybody doing? So we're gonna do uh, Kalakuri here. Super strong character. Um, definitely, uh, definitely one of the best FFBs in the game. Um, he's pretty large. He's one of the largest characters, but he's not a giant. But I mean, being large still helps. Um, let's see. It also means, you know, that. He doesn't have flinch res that the, the Giants have, so he can get slapped around, knocked back, stuff like that. Um, to combat that, he does have color of observation hockey, so what this will do, he'll randomly tech out of hits, so keep him from, you know, flinching, getting hit, knocked down, that type of, that type of thing. It's nice when it happens, it can happen, you know, multiple times know in a row so like I've seen it five times in a row I think um, kind of crazy kind of cool but it is RNG it can also interrupt your um, you know your combos and your attacks so it's kind of a kind of a drawback but for the most part it's it's uh, it's pretty cool um, he is a speed type which means infinite stamina in FFB he does have an eight hit normal attack string um, this one in FFB is incredibly powerful, so he's not too good for styling and comboing. Um, he can do that, but I mean that's that's not what this bid's for. Um, just showing why he's kind of good and OP and how to use him. So this move here, this is going to take him across the screen, much like how you know a giant clear screens. Well, he kind of has something like that. Uh, this one in the air also, so his C5 in the air and his C2 on the ground is basically what you're going to be using when you're not using these two moves here. These are his donut moves, so this is just like Kuzin and his freezing. So he's going to put a donut around an enemy and this works on anything and everything, so even Dragon Kaido. You can put a donut around his waist and um, beat him down pretty easy. It's kind of, kind of crazy, kind of crazy. Put a donut on him, swell on him. Insane. So these two moves, um, this move's obviously the better of the two. This is for just quick application. Uh, this move here, one of the best in the game for what it does. It just does so much. It comes kind of late in the string though, but it's all right for the most part super strong move he only has two donut moves but that's really all you need so drop the donuts move across the screen with this or this and beat down everything with this pretty simple again I'm trying to keep these you know simple and basic um, growth map max these obviously uh, soul map this is all DLC um, it's just power creep and certain skills are going to get you know increased value and you're going to get extra skills new skills such as you know that um, you look in the bottom left you'll see 27 so that's the new uh, caps with all the DLC again I you know I'm really thinking about rolling back my save to 18 attack because 27 is just way too high for the content that we have in the game. Um, yeah. So just power creep. A lot more damage. That's basically all you want for. Stamina is nice to play around with, but, you know, again, speedsters have infinite stamina, and then you have other ways of getting them back. So, Katakuri really doesn't use any stamina at all, which is kind of, kind of cool. Uh, no, specials. So special moves. The so special moves are pretty bad to barely average. Um, this is a four star super, so long charge time, terrible damage. It just rolls right past all of the uh, named officers. So, you know, like a Luffy or Whitebeard, something like that. Just roll right past them. Um, completely, you know, making the move worthless. And then at the end it has a grab and smash, so you could actually miss, you know, um, the character that you really want to grab and smash, but it, it should be okay. Um, and then 
it can just flat out whiff so it's just not not a good move it is a, a four star uh, cutscene super so anything with a fist is considered a cutscene so you don't need deadly cadence you're not going to get interrupted so I mean I guess I guess that's good this will probably be your main super that you're going to be using um, if you want to you really don't need to uh, Katakuri is incredibly strong um, the range on it is it's all right damage it's all right it's a three star not not too not too great nothing special uh, conquers hacky you'll see this on you know the characters that have the uh, you know the conquers hacky you could use a skill to increase its damage but I mean you're giving up a skill slot and it's really yeah all right his other specials this one's terrible it's kind of slow it's really slow especially you know once you once you get going you'll notice it just slows you down and um, I don't like it not good this one here is your your standard one to two star projectile so it's kind of a lengthy move to throw out a bunch of projectiles does no damage waste of time really self heal um, few characters have these they're really kind of bad really bad I mean, I guess if you have Kobe in his DLC and you want to push for higher stages, but you can get healing through the stages themselves, so it's, yeah. Now this brings us to this move here, this two-star trap. So generally when you see this icon, um, you should pay attention. They're quite good. And on Katakuri, it's no exception. So this, he's going to throw out. It's going to do exactly what it says throw out a uh, mochi ball and it's going to rain down bullets pretty good AOE um, persists for quite a bit does tons and tons of hits which um, works in tandem with work up and heat up so it's a very very strong move and basically the only one we're really going to be using all right skills you always want these three on your bar uh, if you have the DLC, bump it up to 4 and then 5. Um, I really don't rock a lot of damage. I mean, I have it here and here and then, you know, something like this. But I already do enough damage, way too much. Um, if you need the damage, just do the old tried and true, the cheat death and heroes. Strength, that's really all you need. If you have the DLC, you're going to get 27 attack, extra slots, all these extra damage. It's just crazy. So primarily quality of life here. Um, Katakuri doesn't use any stamina. So generally I'll have something uh, you know like this but you don't even need it for him. It's you know he doesn't really use stamina and I'll show you why in a bit. Then these last two moves, these are just going to help um, with his donut application, so it's going to last longer. You can apply them easier. All right. So first move that you want to use is this. This will get you around. Of course, I right into the arms of a big burly man. Okay, not good. Jimbe. Uh, try that again. There we go. So. Massive forward movement takes you across the map in no time. Oh, there's Crocodile, my favorite. Another one you could use is this, of course. Knocks him back, good coverage. So, as you can see, he's tech in there, so those three in a row. Kind of cool. Um, can interrupt combos, but generally, you're alright. So, that's a move you could use. The other one is, well I'll show you the air and then we'll do the donut. So in the air, same deal. Takes you across. Okay, then you're... You're not getting uh, back. So, massive forward movement. Doesn't need any stamina dash around. You just get to do so. this. Really crazy. Alright, let's get out of here. Um... Holy moly. Alright. Now let's do our donuts. So, you're in a donut, can't do anything. 
Um, can't charge up. Can't, can't do nothing. Pretty strong. And this one's going to put a, uh, just a little, little cream puff on the screen. Each hit, it will pulse, do damage, and apply donuts. So very strong. So there's law there. Alright, white beard's up. Let's go beef him down. So, with what I've shown already, Katakuri is a very strong character. Massive forward movement. Uh, donuts. RNG techs. Let's do... Let's do this special here. So we're just going to roll right past everybody. The smash. Okay. Not too good. And then we have his, his trap here. Look at that. Look at the hit count. Top right, uh, top left. Just absolutely insane. So especially with stuff like again worked up, heat up. Quite nice. Persists for quite a bit. It's a fair amount of damage. Easy to charge up. So everything that I've shown so far Katakuri is a extremely good character. But now it gets crazy because this FFB is one of the best in the game. Everything that we do, we get extra projectiles. Look at that. Look at that. Crazy. Even on those charge moves. So, hit count. Forward movement. Everything. Crazy. Even in the air. Look at that. Absolutely insane. So now let's put it all together. Okay. Donut. Let's drop that. It's just ridiculous. Then if you want to do other stuff. Crocodile. Donut, not even not even not even worth mentioning his name. Alright, so pretty crazy. Super crazy. So it's just how he works. Putting the donuts, massive range, massive forge movement, um, this combo. Absolutely insane. This one. Just domination. All right, so that's Katakuri. Not flashy. You just do the same thing over and over again. But super strong. So these two. This will be your quick application of your donuts. This will be your donut kick. Smash, whatever. Super, let's finish it off. Alright, insane. Alright, I'm gonna call here. So you guys take care. I'll see you again. Bye.